Hi, Assalamualaikum. Cikgu Zana here and welcome back. Our focus for today's lesson is integration by substitution. It is going to be a very simple and easy lesson. So shall we start? Integration by substitution is also called U substitution since the function that need to be integrated is substituted as U. For example, this function can be integrated by defining U as 2x minus 1 then making U as the new variable of the integration. So by differentiating u with respect to x, to express dx in terms of u, then replace the function in terms of u, that is 2x minus 1 is replaced by u and dx is replaced by half du. Applying the rule of integration, we move half outside the integral so we have the integral of u to the power of 5 integrating we have half times u to the power of 6 over 6 plus c substitute back u in terms of x for the final answer let's try this Which part of the integrand are we going to choose as u? Clearly, we choose the complex part of the integrand, which is u as x cubed minus 2. Then, differentiate making dx as the subject. Replace the function in terms of u. Simplifying. Move the 1 over 3 outside the integral, we have the integral of u to the power of 4 du. Integrating, we have 1 over 3 times u to the power of 5 over 5 plus c. To obtain the final answer, we need to substitute back u in terms of x. Please do not forget to add the constant c as this is an indefinite integral. Try to find the integral of this function. So which part of the integrand are you going to substitute as u? Yes, choose the integrand where the power of x is a degree higher. So let u be 1 plus x cubed. Differentiating making dx as the subject. Replace the function in terms of u. Simplifying. So we have 1 over 3, the integral of 1 over u, du. Now the integration of 1 over u is ln u. Substitute back u in terms of x, we have 1 over 3, ln 1 plus x cubed plus c. Next, let's integrate this function. 2x minus 1 over x plus 1 the whole thing squared with respect to dx. So the part of the integrand to be replaced as u is the expression x plus 1. Differentiating u with respect to x, we have 1, thus dx is equivalent to du. Then, express the function in terms of u. So, your x is replaced by u minus 1. x plus 1 is replaced by u and dx is replaced by du. 
Thus, we have the integral of 2u minus 3 over u squared with respect to du. Simplifying further, we have the integrals of 2 over u minus 3 times u to the power of negative 2 with respect to du. The integral of 2 over u is just 2 log u. The integral of negative 3 times u to the power of negative 2 is 3 over u plus the constant of integration c. So the final answer is obtained by substituting u in terms of x. Here is an example the integration of a root function. When integrating a root function, it is advisable to substitute x minus 4 as u squared, as it would be easier to differentiate. That is, 2u du dx is 1, thus dx is 2u du. Then, the function is replaced in terms of u, so x is replaced by u squared plus 4, and square root x minus 4 is replaced by u, and dx is replaced by 2u du. Using the rule of integration, we can place the constant 2 outside the integral for easy integration. Thus, we have 2 the integral of u to the power 4 plus 4u squared du. Integrating, we have 2 in brackets u to the power 5 over 5 plus 4 times u to the power 3 over 3 plus c. Simplifying further, we have 2 over 5 u to the power 5 plus 8 over 3 times u to the power 3 plus c. So the final answer is obtained by substitute back u in terms of x. Let's find the integral of the following function, x over square root x plus 1. Notice that the denominator of the function is a root function. Thus, u squared is used to substitute x plus 1. Differentiating, we have 2u du over dx equal 1. Thus, dx is 2u du. Next, that function is expressed in terms of u. Thus, x is replaced by u squared minus 1, square root x plus 1 is replaced by u, and dx is replaced by 2u du. Using the rule of integration, we can place the constant 2 outside the integral for easy integration. Thus, we have two integrals of u squared minus 1 du. Integrating, we have 2 in brackets u to the power of 3 divided by 3 minus u plus c. Simplifying, we have 2 over 3 times u to the power of 3 minus 2u plus c. Hence, the final answer is obtained by substituting u in terms of x. In summary, integrals u substitution. There are five steps to be taken. Consider finding the integrals of the given function. The first step is to choose the integral to be substituted as u. So let u be x squared minus 5. Second step is to differentiate and make dx as the subject. The third step is to replace the integrals in terms of u. Then, we integrate. And lastly, replace the answer in terms of x. From the examples, observe that there are two common substitution used, that is, 
for the expression in the form ax plus b the whole thing to the power of n, the substitution u equals ax plus b is used. And for the expression in the form square root ax plus b, the substitution u squared equals ax plus b is used. Hence, we can conclude that the process of integration has become easier by using substitution. That's about all. Please do more practices as practice makes perfect. And thank you for joining Maths with Cikgu Zana. If you have any questions, please do ask in the comment space below. Till then, 